show with Joey Super Compound Radios. I am here. The zucchini, and I had him add artichoke hearts because zucchini, there's no flavor to zucchini, so have something with flavor. And I chose artichoke hearts. All from Blaze Pizza, fast fired. This is Blaze Pizza's uh, veg out, yon. Yeah. Oh, let's check this out. Mmm. 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 Wow, that's good vittles. That gorgonzola cheese is swinging on this. And the pesto, wow. So I put some artichoke hearts, which has flavor. And yeah, you can't go wrong with that. Yummy. Wow. All the flavors. Because you can add anything you want. And I think this is off the hook. This is a 10, everyone. Blip the blade, blip the blade, blip the blade, blip the blade, blip the Get the Blaze Pizza. Tell the world about Blaze Pizza. It is off the hook. Check out the veggie. If you're a vegetarian, you're gonna love this. It's so good. And they have, it's a really cool place and you will all like it a lot. And we'll see you on the flip side, everyone. And as Luke Skywalker always says, do they have, do they have spaghetti pizza like, like uh, that one place does? What's it called? Chuck E. Cheese? I like spaghetti pizza, being, ch being uh, chewy like it a lot. Veg out, yeah. <laughs> What's up, people? Would it be what it do? Happy Man Snacks back again with a new review. Caramel fries, which I have to say are pretty delicious, man. I would say these rival McDonald's fries. Closest to McDonald's fries that you'll find. Almost shoestring, nice, light, potato-y. Great salt content on them. My mom would be proud of these. They gotta be soft and really good. Alright, I'm sure they're salted. <laughs> Look at this bun, man. That is nice. I love their buns. Super melty, super gooey, and everywhere, and you're just loving it. But it almost has like a maltiness aftertone to it that kicks it up a notch, makes it more of like an adult cheese sauce. You know what I mean? Hello, everyone. This is Running on Empty Food Review. So today, uh, we're back at Planet Wings, the suicidal wings. Right, let's see, let's see how hot they really are. Going in. Oh, jeez. Woo! That's hot. I'll tell you. Get the straw here first. That one wing. Holy crap. That's hot. I'm on the verge of tearing right now. Not gonna lie. Woo! Man, that's hot. Must say. Without a doubt, this is the hottest wing I've ever had. Hi everybody, Robert Dyer, and welcome, welcome to the Robert Dyer Channel Halloween Countdown. Where we have just about two days to go here. One day, depending when you're watching this. And today I have another special product this morning for a Halloween breakfast cereal. And this is Quaker Life Limited Edition Pumpkin Spice Life. Now, one of my earliest cereal memories is life cereal it's always been one of my favorite cereals since i was a small child hello and welcome to another episode in gary's food review today i'll be reviewing the shrek cereal so let's give this a try it's all fruit loop ish 
<laughs> so the Shrek cereal tastes very similar to Fruit Loops, but it has the feel and the texture of Apple Jacks. So it has the soft loops like Apple Jacks, so it isn't as hard as Fruit Loops. But and then have the apple-ish taste like Apple Jacks. It tastes more like Fruit Loops, but it's like a softer loop like Apple Jacks. So it's like Apple Jacks meets Fruit Loops combined. Pretty much Apple Jacks with the Fruit Loop taste. So yeah, not bad. So overall on the food taste scale, overall, I would have to give the Shrek cereal a 7 out of 10. It's good, but yeah, it isn't the greatest cereal ever, but it's pretty much Fruit Loops meets Apple Jacks.